Hi, my name is Rob Ray with MP3 Car. I'm here at Telematics Detroit 2009, and we're in a 2010 Ford Taurus, which has Ford Sinks version 3 in it. And I'm here with Mark Schunder, who did a lot of the research and development to bring this product to market. So he's going to give us a quick driving tour and a quick tour of some of the features that are in the new version of Sync version 3. So what's happening here with the route guidance is that the iPhone that's here in the drink holder is connected wirelessly via Bluetooth to the Taurus and Ford Sync version 3. Um, and when we do our voice request, there is some software that's made by Airbiquity that takes, that sends data back and forth from the car using a voice connection. So for those of you who remember the old days when we had modems to do data over a standard analog line, that's basically what Airbiquity does with a cellular voice link. So why this is cool is that you don't have to have a data plan, you don't have to have an expensive service. Anything with a Bluetooth voice linking phone can work in Ford Sync version 3. How does Sync handle when you're off you route? left the planned route. Ah. Would you like to update? Please say yes or no. Yes. Sync, please say a command. Services. Connecting. Service do you want? Sports. Sports. Say the name of a sport or say, tell me my choices. NHL. NHL. Here are the latest NHL scores. At any time you can press the voice button and say an NHL team name or say another sport. Yesterday, the Penguins down the Red Wings 4-2. to two. The Penguins trailed the series one game to two. That's all for the NHL. Check back again for more results. Say an NHL team name or say the name of another sport. So it was interesting there that it uh, gave us our route guidance. It didn't, mm -hmm. it didn't kill our route guidance. It, it, it let us, it, it beeped, told us that we needed to turn right ahead, but it knew that the sports scores were more priority than our route guidance. Yeah, so what happened was um, we were on a services call, you know, talking to the, getting our sports scores, and prior to making the call, we had deviated from our route. Mm -hmm. And what happened was, is we just came back to the route, what you saw on the display, it said on route, and now we'll get turn instructions back to where we're going. I mean, when you consider the, the, the nav systems out that are on the market now are anywhere from fifteen, uh, fifteen hundred to two thousand dollars Yeah. Um, uh, this is free for three years. It's a pretty good value. And after three years, what does it cost? Uh, $95 a year if you want to re-up. Okay. And if you don't want to re-up, what are the basic services that you get for free? If you choose not to re-up uh, the services subscription uh, after three years, um, you just get that basic functionality. You get v Sync V1, which is, the, the of course, the, the phone and the media player connectivity. Okay. And then you get uh, V2, which is the E911 and the, uh, uh, or 911, and then you get... Uh, well, Mark, thanks a lot mm -hmm. for taking the time to do this interview. And I, I know our forum members and people in labs have been doing this stuff for years, but it's great to finally actually get something that you can go to the dealership and buy that works well at a reasonable price. So good luck mm -hmm. to you. Thank you.